Good morning and I hope you've been well and this is part 2 of the Stardew Valley Let's Play Soya. So I believe for today's episode we are going to go on ahead and introduce ourselves to the townspeople. So yeah, I also wanted to say real quick thanks to everybody that decided to check out the first episode. Wasn't really expecting a lot of you so it was a little bit surprising to see quite a few people decide to check it out and hopefully a few of you decide to stick along for the series and if not that's totally fine and understandable as I've always said I know I'm not for everybody so yeah I also wanted to say thanks to the longtime viewer again for introducing the game to me and giving me some uh, tips and pointers and answering a few questions that I had so yeah I guess the first one that I did have I believe if I remember correctly so I guess we'll use this guy here for an example I guess there is a thing that you can actually like have a relationship with people um, now I don't know what it means like her and him for an example I don't know why two hearts well he even he has a two like there's some with two that are dark or is it all like that Oh, okay. It is all like that. Oh, you know what I bet it is? So, these people here, for an example... Right, you could be very friendly, but these are the people that you can have, like, a relationship with. And I assume the first two... Sorry, the last two... Probably have to do something with the marriage? Because apparently he said you can get married within this game or something like that, so... I assume that's what that's all about, so... Yeah, and also, man, we have a lot of land. Hold up. Also, can we? Oh, we are. Okay, so that's walking. And I assume we're auto running, I guess, or maybe not. I, I can't tell. But I guess we're going the wrong way, but that's okay. I kind of want to explore a little bit, actually. Oh, yeah, and another thing, he told me that apparently that the beach farm it's like the hardest one to do so of course somehow I find myself choosing one of the more difficult ones so yeah but we'll make it work we'll make it work now what's this huh maybe that's something we'll rebuild in the future now let me go to the map okay I'm going away from the town hold up well Oh, what's this? Wait for my return on the dawn of your third year. Okay. Oh, Grandpa's Shrine. Okay. The third year. Okay. Gotcha. Then I'll have to make a little note on that. Because I'll probably forget. Alright. Well, I guess we do have some, like, grassy land over here, though. It's not all, you know, sand, so... We can definitely make a farm here. Now, again, I am a boomer when it comes to gaming, and for this game, I I've never played it, or really anything like this. I mean, I have played, like, Minecraft before, but the layout seems a lot more different so yeah but we'll get used to it and we'll learn as we go well I will learn as I go but you get the point so I guess we can't go that way so let's make our way over here and I also got to keep in mind I believe they said that crates can sometimes uh, make their way on the shore so I do want to keep my eye out for that as well Let's see here. Farm, Pelican Town. Okay, so we want to go... Oh, hold up. No, don't do that. Jazz. Interesting name. Hi. Is that... Okay, we'll leave her alone. I'm pretty sure she's... Right? Oh, she's like the first one. Oh. Birthday, Summer 4. 
Oh, so there's like logs of like... Wait, what? Spring 7, I don't know what that means. Maybe like day 7? Can I... There we go. Okay, so we can only do that if we've actually like met them before. Okay. Gotcha. Well then let me... If she was just out in the open, then there, there might be more. And I don't believe it's a bad idea to meet as many people as possible. Oh, here we go. Uh, Haley. Let me move my mouse to the corner. Oh, you're that new farmer boy, aren't you? Huh? Oh, I'm Haley. Is that it? Hmm, if it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. Okay. Bye, Haley. Uh, let's see here. So I believe we're in the town, right? Right, okay, so this is... Ooh, a cow. Right, we can also have, like, livestock and whatnot, too. But I don't know how easy it's gonna be with the beach farm. We'll, we'll, we'll get there when we get there. So... Well, this is a nice little place. I, I don't want to go back there. I assume that's somebody's room um right okay so you can't okay right i don't really see anybody here it's locked with shane okay well then let me leave this place alone then i, I thought it was like a little oh hold up uh, Mayor Lewis told me you just arrived. I'm Marnie, I think is how you pronounce that. I sell livestock and animals. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, uh, care products at my ranch. You should swing by some time. I definitely will when I am able to uh, get some livestock. Because I safely assume I would have to like cut trees. It's similar to like Minecraft. Um... Build like a fence, build like a farm and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah. I think she... Okay, so she's in here. I guess I can't really talk to her anymore. Okay. Uh, let's see here. It's already 2.12. Or 2.12? 2.20. It appears I cannot read today. And I gotta say, that's something that I've noticed. It seems that the time goes by really quickly. Only Lee's friends can enter uninvited. Okay. Um, okay, so can't go over there. Um, was there any other... Let's see, Haley's getting some photos... The one girl Jazz, or Jess, was up there. Kind of curious, was there any other person around here before I, like, go further on into the town? I feel like I'm going a little bit too far out. You know, let me, let's keep it simple. I'll explore when I want to explore, even though I kind of want to. The problem with me with, like, games is I... I am known to derail whether it's within like games or just talking in general and knowing me I'm going to derail and spend so much time like looking around. Let's just go at the objectives and let's um let's meet people. Let's not get a little bit too carried away and you know derail from the goal. Well somebody walked into the home there. Okay, met five people. If you want to become a farmer, you have to start with the basics. Use your hoe to till the soil. 
Then use a seed packet on the tilled soil to sow a crop. Water every day until the crop is ready for harvest. Okay. We'll get into that later. For now... No, don't do that. Oh, maybe a shop is in here? I kind of feel bad being in our home like this. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. Or JD, Jody, I, I can't tell if that's an O or an A. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. Okay. So, I mean, I assume by, like, generating money, we would, like, sell, um, like, our, like, crops and all of that, I would, I would have to imagine. Oh, you're new. Vincent. Oh, a stranger. My name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you see, but you seem okay. Sorry. Cool, cool. Oh, you're also new. Hey, Harvey. It's a pleasure to meet you. I'm Harvey, the local doctor. Oh, that's cool. So it seems like like they have like their own like small like town. Well, not even town. Well, it is a town, but like a small like, community. Like we have the person that does livestock. Hopefully you can be our farmer. We have a doctor here and probably like other, you know, important, you know, jobs that, you know, help out within the town. I honestly like like that, you know, it's really interesting. I perform regular checkups and medical procedures for all the residents of Pelican Town. It's a rewarding job. I hope you'll find your own work equally rewarding in time. Thanks, Harvey. Let's see here. Um, right, am I going... Well, let me... Let me go down. Man, it's already almost like six. Oh, okay, so here's like the doctor's uh, place. Nine to three p.m., okay. So... So I assume Monday the 1st. Oh! Okay, so... If I had to guess, like for an example, if I... On... Oh, that's interesting. So... Hopefully, for an example, like... Let's say I don't play the game, like, till, like, three days later. Will it be, like, Thursday if I don't touch the game? Or would it continue as, like, I play, like, if I open the game, it's Tuesday and then Wednesday? Hopefully that question kind of makes sense. Because, like, what I'm gathering is, like, if I go to, like, their uh, birthdays, right? Um, I assume you would get, like, friendship points uh, with them, so... Yeah. Maybe, maybe not. I, I, I don't know. And I keep swinging the pickaxe there. Sorry about that. Pure, what's going on, bro? Hey, it's Mr. Barrel, the new farmer. I'm Pure, owner of the local general store. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Thanks, Pure. A little agriculture could really inject a new life into the local economy. Oh, somebody's in there. I kind of already feel bad going into like the rooms. Not good enough friends. Right, okay, let me, let me not worry about those doors. What about you? Carolyn. Hello, you must be Beryl, the new farmer. I'm Carolyn. My husband runs the general store here, and you have met my daughter, Abigail. She's the pale one with purple hair. Pale one with purple hair? Who are you? Pale with purple hair? Am I blind? Oh, 
her. Okay. Gotcha. I was about to say, I don't recognize anybody with purple hair. Um. Oh, that's kind of neat. No, don't do that. Altar of Yoba. I have no idea who that is. Um. Okay, so it's nighttime. And I assume... Oh, hey, Pierre. I will make my way out of the door. But no, I have not met the one girl. Um, oh, whoops. Let me do this. Okay, let's make our... Let's make our way back. Since it's getting close to nighttime. And I wonder if, like, the days matter. Like, for an example, day one, these people come out, and then the next day, new people will appear. I would assume so. Okay. Uh, yes. Okay. I don't know if we're going to be able to meet every single person, though. I mean, we'll go back. Because I do want to meet, like, as many people as I can. I guess we'll make our way back. Let's see what happens. Or maybe, since it was, like, nighttime... With that one... Oh, okay. Till nine. Well then, if it's, like, only, like, six, maybe not a lot of people. Okay. You know, let me do this. It doesn't seem like a lot of people are gonna be out and about right now. Let's go back to the farm. Let's do some learning. Oops, wrong button. Uh, I believe it's over here. Right. Oh, mail. Hello there. Just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for you, Willie. Um. Oops. There we go. Down by the beach. Um. Okay, Willie. I don't recognize... Real quick. Oh. But I see that little E on the side. Um. Oh. Okay. Why am I... Maybe I gotta be at the front of it? Like this? Okay. So it's not like I can't do it from the... Oh, no, I can. Oh, a geode. Oh, interesting. Okay. Um, before I get carried away... Let me... Oh, no, don't do that. I wonder what that is. But yeah, let me go... Let me go find Willy before I forget. Down by the beach. Um... I don't see him. I guess we'll follow the shore. Um... Before 5 p.m. Okay. So I assume we'll just kind of like stay on this shoreline. Maybe... Down... I don't think that's right. 
No, we're getting away from the water. Well, or maybe he's like, like way over here. Maybe, let me, let me look over here. Cause I don't want to miss out on Willy just to see what he's got to say. I'm gonna bet it's the one farther down, not like on my property. That's what I'm gonna guess, honestly. All right, I guess we're gonna go that way then. Plus it's already like 10.30, so I assume some people would be out and about. And also, Oh, hold up. Oh, a lot of new people. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Cool, cool. Hold up. Evelyn, what's going on? Why, hello and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. My husband, Kent, is a soldier working overseas. That's why he's not here right now. I know he'll come back safe once he's to once his tour is over. Well, best of luck to him. Need something? No, just saying hey. Uh, nothing posted. Okay. Let me... Oh, hold up. Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. I have not. Not even close. How many have I... I wonder what the X's mean though. No idea. I mean like the... the green. X, I... That I don't know. Okay. Um... Oh, here she is. The one person that, uh, they were talking about. What's going on, Abigail? Oh, that's right. I heard someone new was moving on to the old farm. It's kind of a shame, really. I always enjoyed exploring those overgrown fields by myself. Alrighty. Um, sure, why not? We'll buy something. Oh, no, I've talked to you, right? Yeah, I have. Okay. Was there anybody... Man, there is a hold up. There, there are a lot of people in here. Hold up. Oh wait, we've talked to you before. That's Robin. We've talked to you. I didn't mean to skip her text though. He helps me out with the chicken, so I'm not complaining. Sorry. What was your name again, Caroline? I didn't mean to skip your text. Alright, you guys have fun. Lewis, what's going on, bro? So, how was your first night in the old cottage? I do all my grocery shopping here. I do all my grocery shopping here. Good for you. Okay. Let me get on out of here. And... Oh, you're new. Alex, what's going on, bro? Oh, hey, so you're the new guy, huh? Cool. I'll see you around. I'm sure we will. Uh, let's see. Right, Willie. I don't want to forget him. Join us thrive. Oh my god. It's not happening, Jojo. I left you for a reason. 
and I'm never going back. I cannot believe they, of all people, are here. Yo, what's going on? Upgrade tools. Uh, oh, so I can't really... Oh, I can, okay. Hi, I'm Clint. I'm the town's blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Hold up. I have a geodude. Or geodude. A geode. Not a geodude. What can you do about this thing? Huh? Um... Gunther can tell you more about this if you donate it to the museum. Okay. So there's a museum here. Man, there, there is a lot. No, don't do that. Wait, okay. Stop. Let's, oh, no. We're not stopping. Wait, what? I didn't mean to skip that. You're new, though. Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Alrighty. Uh, can we... What? Okay. I assume that's pretty much it with them. I don't know if it really matters, like, talking to, like, everybody like that. I... I well, hold up, you're new. I, I assume to some level it is important. With, like, the story and the community and all that. Somebody can let me know if so or if not. Uh, hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. Good to meet you as well, Sam. But I assume, again, like I've said multiple... You've got to be Willy. But, like I was about to say, I, I'm more than certain that doing that kind of stuff is important. I already love you, bro. You look cool. You got character. Ahoy there, son. Aye, Captain. Heard there was a newcomer in town. Good, finally, to meet you. Ah... I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, I want you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive and hey, maybe you'll be buying something from my shop once in a while. Thanks, Willy. I appreciate it. You received a bamboo pole. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now, so come on by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. If it smells, it sells. That's what my old pappy used to say anyways. It's honestly a neat little saying for the... Like, fishing market and all of that. Thanks, Willy. And plus, it kind of, like, makes sense since we're near, like, the beach waters to actually have a fishing pole. So, for an example, then... Um... Willy, can I... Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. Trout soup. Training rod. I can have a fish tank? Oh, you should have not shown me that, Willy. I love aquariums. I love fish tanks. I'm going to be the greatest farmer ever to just have hordes of fish tanks. Oh my god. I'm sold on this game already. Well, I already bought the game, but I, I already know I'm going to love it even more now. Just because of that. It's so odd because, um... I remember, I got a comment, um... I, I don't remember who it was. But somebody was, like, curious on, like, the animals and whatnot that I have. I have more so, um... Well, just to say, I'm more so into, like, um... Well, hold up. 
you're new. What type of dude are you? You look like that one guy from like Shrek. What the hell was his name? He didn't have as long as hair as that one guy, but I don't know why. It reminds me of that one guy. Oh, I forgot his name. People probably know what I'm talking about. Uh, the new farmer we've all been expecting and whose arrival has sparkled many conversations. I'm Elliot. I live in the little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thanks, Elliot. Um, love the long hair, too. Oh, sewers over there. Won't worry about that for now. But no, um, our beloved mana or mana. I am not even going to attempt to read that. It's old and faded. But um, b back to what I was saying, though. Well, before that, I want to go to the Mayor's Manor. Joja. Wasn't there a... Maybe one of these are the museums up there? There's somebody way out there. Ruin. Lonely Stone. I mean, I guess we... Oh, okay, so that's where Ellie lives. Okay. Well, for now... We've already met quite a few people. But there's still a lot that we haven't. Who are you? I don't remember you. But yeah, there's... But I wonder, what does the X mean, though? I thought that would go... Oh, that that's how you go through the characters. Okay. I guess somebody can, like, let me know. I, I won't worry about that right now. Okay, but back to uh, fish and all of that kind of stuff before I forget. So, um... Right, somebody was like asking a while back on like the aquariums and all of that, so yeah, I, I guess I'll um, well, sorry, another interruption here. Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed, but I think deep down he actually loved that house. I'm sure he did. Alright, let me make my, let's make our way back to the home here and I'm sure as we like go in and out of town we'll meet some of those new people that I haven't really met yet I think I'm going the wrong way that's okay I guess we could just keep this as like an exploration video and then next episode maybe more so focus on uh, the farming and all of that I guess a little swing set there. But right, as we're uh, walking around, fish tanks. Now let me do it. So, yeah, I, I've been into, like, aquariums and aquatics for... God, over, like... Voice crack there. Probably over, like, ten years. I got into it when I was, like... Man, I'm old, actually. Hold up. Because I'm in my 20s now. I've gotten into it when I was probably like five or six honestly and yeah currently right now i have more uh, larger fish um because like what was it i have them in well the aquarium that i have um uh currently is a 220 gallon aquarium and i've been growing a few uh catfish because um catfish are actually my favorite animal if anyone's curious so yeah. I lost my train of thought. Right. Um, pretty much what I have in there right now is a, um, a Megalodorus. A, and you can like look it up. It's a type of like armored cat. It's really cool looking. I have a couple of Lima cats. I love them a lot. They're very fun. Um, I have a Sailfin Pictus. He's definitely the largest of all of the uh, fish that I got in there. 
I got a marble cat and a tiger nose shovel nose hybrid with a marble cat and it's honestly like a really pretty hybrid so yeah now um they're right now in a 220 um if anyone's curious like doesn't that seem a little cramped for those kind of like fish for the time being it somewhat is me and um like my father were like into all of that um, we have everything situated for a much more uh, larger uh, aquarium for them so soon we'll be you know moving them on over into that and maybe one day I might during one of these videos do like a little like um, like a clip of like all of that when everything's all said and done so yeah oof uh, sorry for the pause there but um we're back now, but uh, yeah. Anyways, um, I, I think that'll be it for today's episode. Maybe in the future, like I brought it before, I'll probably, um, once I get everything like done with all of that, um, might do like a video showing that and all of that. Once again, we get that all situated with the uh, aquarium and all of that. But um, yeah, I'm very into like the um, aquarium hobby and all of that. So yeah. Now I believe for next episode, since we. And the X's are gone. Nice. I was kind of hoping the X would stay there to signal the people that we met so I know that we met them. I guess not. Not sure why they went away, but um, we'll meet more people as we continue on, but um, I'm not too worried about that. Worst case scenario, I'm, I might go back through the video and maybe write down like a list or something so I know who I met who I haven't met but either way it's probably important to talk to them whether you did or didn't regardless and right because like I still haven't been up here down there is new and I haven't really hung around some of these areas often so yeah but we'll get that all situated soon. For the next episode, though, I really want to focus more so on, um, whatchamacallit, clearing up the land over here. And, um, whatchamacallit. Yeah, getting this all cleared up and possibly maybe building a little farm somewhere nearby. I don't know where, but somewhere we'll learn how to like build a fence and get all of that situated so yeah but with that being said i think that'll be it for today's episode thank you guys so much for watching definitely do appreciate it and i will see you guys in the next episode good morning